Hello everyone. Previously, we already learned about the introduction about chemical species and reaction rate. Today, we're going to learn about the general mole balance equation. The mole balance equation can be applied to different type of reactor, such as batch reactor, continuous steer tank reactor, plug flow reactor, or packet bed reactor. But before that, let's derive the mole balance equation in general. Let's imagine volume of a system V where a chemical reaction happened. At any time, we can define few things. For example, in here, we can define molar flow rate of a species J that coming in into the volume. We can also define the molar flow rate of the species J that coming out. And then inside the volume, we can have the molar rate generation of a species G. And all of this will be accumulated and can be defined as a molar rate accumulation of a species G. Keep in mind that the unit of molar flow rate of a species J that coming in, the one that coming out, the molar rate generation, and the molar rate accumulation are in unit mole per unit time. Let's take a look a little bit closer to the generation of species J inside the volume of the reaction. The generation of species J can be defined as a rate of a reaction for the entire volume. In this case, Rj multiplied by the V. The entire volume V can be defined into small volume. For example, we can take delta V1 and inside delta V1, we can have the reaction. We call it Rj1. We can also take delta V2 and inside delta V2, we have a reaction Rj2 and so on. So in the entire volume of V, we can have many number of delta V. And if we take the limit of delta V goes to zero and the number of delta V goes to infinity, we will have the integral form of Rj dV. So now we can change our mole balance equation by substitute the molar rate generation of species J into integral form of Rj dV. So now we can write the general mole balance of any species. In this case, a species A, the mole of A in per unit time minus mole of A out per unit time plus the generation mole of A per unit time equal to the accumulation mole of A per unit time. Mm -hmm. 